Good evening, I'm Madison Stacy. Bloomington Pride is hosting a summer fest celebration in honor of the LGBTQ community and their allies tomorrow. The all day block party kicks off with a pride parade at Cardinal Spirits and will end on 4th Street. The festival will also feature free HIV testing, arts and crafts, and discussions about issues facing the LGBTQ community. I think it sends a really important symbol to everybody that like, if you are queer, that you're accepted and you could get married to the person you love. The ACLU of Indiana is suing the state, claiming that Indiana's law that prohibits voters from taking selfies showing their election ballots violates First Amendment free speech rights. The law was part of a broader package to changes to election law, which also loosened restrictions on using cell phones in polling places. The case was filed in the U.S. Dis District Court for the Southern District of Indiana in Indianapolis. And the Indiana State Department of Health announced Friday it's investigating more cases of HIV linked to the outbreak in Scott County. The number of positive cases has climbed to 181 since the outbreak started at the beginning of the year, and at least six of those cases have been diagnosed in the past month. And the majority of the cases involved in the outbreak have been traced back to injection drug use in Scott County. Other communities throughout Indiana have impl implemented or requested needle exchange programs to prevent the outbreak from spreading further. And we'll get a check of the weather. Tonight, it'll be partly cloudy, lows in the mid-60s. Five-day forecast we're looking at now. Saturday, partly cloudy with a 30% chance of thunderstorms. Highs in the mid-80s, lows in the upper 60s. Sunday, it'll be mostly cloudy with a 30% chance of thunderstorms. Highs in the mid-80s and lows in the mid-60s. Monday, it'll be partly cloudy. Highs in the mid-80s, lows in the upper 60s. Tuesday, again partly cloudy. Highs in the mid-80s, lows in the upper 60s. Wednesday, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of thunderstorms. For for more local news, go to WTIUnews.org.